One day, horrible day, 7th of October 2006, in the elevator of her, her own house, she was killed by somebody, some bastards. The evidence keeps building in the death of journalist Jamal Khashoggi. The proportion of journalists killed in supposedly peaceful countries has gone up. Impunity remains entrenched. Governments have demonstrated a lack of political will in resolving these cases. Uh, censorship is accomplished uh, through murder. A safer world for the truth is needed to find new evidence and push judicial authorities to reopen these cases and bring justice for the sake of the truth. So we have to remind him and we have to do not forget his story. Something like this event encourage all of us against these killers to not stop. It seems to me you should not need to have a courageous, articulate, brilliant widow like Penny or a son like Matthew or a fiance like Hatice to secure even the most basic of steps towards accountability. En Veracruz nos convertimos en, en fotógrafos de guerra. Yo espero que este sea el inicio de muchos casos. Y eso ha provocado evidentemente otros mecanismos para intentar silenciar a los periodistas. Bueno, si no lo puedo comprar, ¿qué hago? Lo amenazo, lo mato o lo desaparezco. I think their name should be heard. They were killed because they were doing their job properly. Vishe Bajene Uno, Madivedi. Lasanta Manilal Vikramatunga Mahatage Vimarshane. The most dangerous professions in the eyes of the regime are journalists, because journalists are truth seekers. They expose the crimes of the regime, and therefore they are exceptionally suspect in the eyes of the regime. Nationally renowned reporters who investigated government corruption and organized crime. Demanding swift action in response to the killing that has shocked the country and There is a huge hope for the future that the situation improves. And the fact that we have this People's Tribunal today is the first sign of hope. Your tribunal does not have the capacity to put perpetrators behind bars, but you have the capacity to name and shame. Mm -hmm.